Under the mask of darkness, the moving van started pulling away from the Phoenix complex. They were taking away equipment, furniture, memorabilia of the Phoenix tradition, and they were bound for Los Angeles. The last of the trucks left in the dreary gray of morning. Not far behind were coaches and employees who had just come from a meeting. There was nothing left to take. They took everything. Everything that was in our desks, on our desks. Mike Chernoff had us in a, not a meeting room with no chairs or no table. Everything's gone. The building's empty and we're, the move is, we've made the move. To the Phoenix exodus was well protected by police and security, but it wasn't needed. The only reaction of the few diehard fans that came to watch was sadness. Broken to good word. When you've got over half your life involved with this ball club, like I have. With nearly everyone gone, the last word from the Phoenix offices came from a team employee who had just become a former employee. It's over, so I just didn't want you guys freezing out here and getting all wet and sick out of this, you know, because it's, it's finished. About noon, two security guards locked up the gates. This is no longer the home of the Pensac and Del Fuego Phoenix.